we address the elephant in the room now go hit that subscribe button because you know you've been watching a couple of months you haven't this is your first video okay just subscribe anyway like come on like subscribing is for free so as you know i'm antonio this is my friend hello dj Oso Loso. we thought it'd be a good idea me being from the uk and him being from wherever he's from the us <laughs> we thought it'd be a good idea to come together to show you some do's and don'ts during ramadan whether you live here or you're coming for a holiday stay tuned Thank you. If you're out in the public during the day, make sure you cover your shoulders and your knees. Um, if you want to go over the top, you can dress like an Arabic woman, cover your hair, wear a bai looking things, but under no circumstances you do wear tight, show your arms or your legs. Definitely not. Most restaurants in malls and out and about on the beach will be closed during the day, and but you can go to the food court or get takeaway. Eating and drinking in public is not allowed. Even if you're doing what I'm doing here and try to hide and eat, it's not allowed. Put it away now. You're also not allowed to chew gum in public. That's also seen as eating. To be honest, you can't chew gum like this at any time of the year. There are some bars and clubs open, uh, but you won't have any live music and it will be soft music, but like background music playing. There will be places to go, but no one really goes out during Ramadan, so if you come in, don't come to turn up. So yeah, there'll be absolutely no DJs, yep, no exceptions, turn it off. Do give to charity and help those in need because during Ramadan your reward is seven times over. Hello. I know it's Ramadan. I don't have much, but I can give you what I have. Talking to people is my primary function. Thank you. Oh, you're gonna take all of it? As it's for. But how are you poor with all that makeup on? <laughs> during Ramadan there's absolutely no PDA. What? What's oh, it? I thought I could touch you. No, no, no. Right, that was us just having a bit of fun to show you some of the do's and don'ts during Ramadan. Some things we left out was one, make sure you do go to iftar, which is when the Muslims break their fast at sunset. Uh, make sure you take in all the culture. There's some really fancy ones like at the palm. Um, try not to be on the roads during sunset to make sure the people that are breaking their fast can get home to break their fast on time because obviously they haven't eaten for that long. Make sure you do greet other Muslims, or not other Muslims, Muslims with Ramadan cream, similar to Merry Christmas. Uh, seasonal greetings. The loud music also applies to in your home and in your car. So there'll be no loud music in the clubs or in your car. The last but not least, my favourite, all work days are shorter by two hours during Ramadan. <laughs> right, we hope this helped you and you enjoyed it. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Thank y'all for watching her channel. Subscribe. Subscribe. Remember, she said it's free. Just hit it. Subscribe it. It's for free. <laughs> Peace. Um, you won't really feel Ramadan in your hotel. So if you are staying in a hotel, don't have any worries about food and drink and stuff. Just FYI. <laughs>